What's going on guys and welcome to a video I've been very excited to make since I found out what was in the in well what was in store for us in terms of weapons anyway but we ended up getting it for free with the uh, Ubisoft uh, well giving us all the weapons in the battle pass basically guys today we are using the ARX 200 now if you look at the stats of this gun they're pretty much incredible above and beyond every other assault rifle in the game in terms of overall spec this has to be the best assault rifle in the game like not just in my opinion but because it has to be look at it it's it's incredible now i didn't manage to get anything with any kind of crazy variables we've only got plus 30 mobility and plus the minus 30 technique cooldown so it's not the best but uh, it's still all right. Um, we've already got to Mark 1 as well, but look at that. Accuracy is amazing. Handling could be a little bit better, but that's still good um, for an assault rifle. Range is amazing. Mobility, recoil, everything. It's all good, and it looks incredible too. I think you'll agree with me there. We've gone for an extended mag, suppressor, moldy A, comp. Nope, don't want that sight. In fact, I'm going to go with a micro T sight, but... No, I'm going I'm to go with digital. But look down here, there's a Micro T1 XG33 sight. That's new, right? I don't know. It doesn't tell me how to get it. I have no idea how to get it. If any of you guys know how to actually access this scope, please do let me know in the comments down below because I really want it. I love the Micro T sight and it sort of mixes it in with a different one for a dual range kind of situation. But yeah, pretty nice. Oh, and also the shift vertical foregrip too. But in this episode, we're going to be checking out this weapon. We're going to go down here, take out everybody in this base. It should be a really fun place to uh, sort of attack. I do need to change my backpack, though. One second. There you go. That's better. But I will say, guys, if you go on to enjoy this video, as always, let's aim for a thousand likes on it. And ooh, if you feel like being extra crazy, subscribe if you're new and you want to, that is. Or you can become a member by hitting the join button next to it. But also... Check the links in the description below so you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and check out the merch store. Now, I'm going to try. I don't know. This may be single shot. This may be full auto. It may be burst. I'm not too sure, but that's a beauty right there. That's where the range is coming into play. Very nice. I, I do plan on going into this camp, but whatever damage I can do before we actually go in is going to be very interesting. Okay. Hitting some kind of invisible wall there. He died eventually. Beautiful, he's out. I could try and go for them, but that's a risky one. This gun is already too good. It's already too good. Don't forget, if we'd have got one with the plus 30 range on this thing, imagine what it'd be like then. And if we had that new scope as well, which allowed us to actually utilize said range, it would just be sick. Come on, man. There you go. We doing okay? We are, you know. I don't think anyone actually knows what's going on here. It's a big guy over there, so I won't touch him just yet. Though I want to. Got you over there, sir. He started walking, so his head moved. It still got him in the end. All the way over there. That's a shot and a half. I mean, if there's no one around him and he stops in my uh, sort of tracks... Nah, that's not happening. Didn't know you could hold your breath on every weapon, actually. That's new to me, or maybe it's because it's like quite a big scope. I don't know. Uh, is he walking inside of that place? Yep. That ain't cool. This isn't good. This is not good. I could try and get him. This is silly. He's dead. Nope. It's a big guy. I couldn't. I can't see him because of the shadow in there. Is that him? Yep. We've definitely gone loud now, though. Here you go. Everyone's running inside, as they always do, like clockwork. Yeah. Now, though, we get the chance to go in and do this on foot. Let me just see if I can parachute down here. Go on, mate. No? No, oh, no, 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 please. I don't want to have to do the whole walk. Okay. Hold on. We haven't tried full auto on this. Oh, it gets better. It gets better. I'm not letting you get away. Even if I... There you go. That's incredible. Fire rate, amazing. Range, amazing. In fact, you're better off just leaving it on full auto, you know. Is there a burst? 
No, there's no burst. It's single shot or full auto. But yeah, you're better off leaving it on full auto so that when you fire in your shots, it should normally kill him. What are you supposedly hiding behind? Is there a platform or a barrier there? Is that what blocked my shots originally before? I don't know. But I like how they came out onto the roof and didn't just hide inside like they normally tend to do. That was nice to see. All right. Hello. Man, he's getting lucky. He got so lucky that reload speed not too shabby either. This is definitely my favorite assault rifle. Like by 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 far. Uh, the pre technically the last episode we did was the silver steak. That was an assault rifle, but I'm treating more that more like a sniper because it just worked better as a sniper or a DMR than it did as, as an assault rifle, in my opinion. I mean, it could do both, but this it, this knows what it is. In fact, this is the same as that. I don't know. I don't know. Basically, I just... Oh, yes. I don't want to be saying every weapon's my favorite. Okay, let's see how it does at close quarters. Third person action. With uh, a bit of survival on the mind. Survival on the brain. You can stop working for a second. Distracting me with your propellers. What? Do, what's the actual objective here? Locating a prisoner? Maybe a target truck. I'm not too sure. Nice one. Broke your ankles. All right, where is everybody else? Got him. Very nice. Moving through. I see you. Not too shabby. Thing is, we've taken out so many people, so I don't expect there to be that many people left. Just a few stragglers walking around, itching their balls, not knowing what's going on. Just a little indication of the fire rate and the beautiful damage this thing does. Or not, in that situation, anyway. Towie? Towie? Did you, did you just say Towie? Did you say Towie's down? I think he said Towie's down. Towie's down, I oh, know. Towie's down, man. There he is. So is your whole family, fam. Deal with it. All right, we're good, I think. Let's just go and uh, I think it's a prisoner who's lost himself inside of here. So let's grab him, get him to safety. And move on to the next thing. If we can find the guy, that is. Or the lady. I feel like it's not going to be easy to find them, is it? Oh! That <laughs> could have been terrible, but it wasn't. Go on. Shh. 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 Okay. Lovely. Nice. It can do it all, folks. It can do it all. Also, my outfit right now, I'm loving it. This is, I guess, I got, I got, I got the camo and the uh, the gear paint from... Well, from the new update thing. Because I definitely didn't have them before, but I'm glad I've got them now. Nice big guy just around this corner. Not today, mate. Not today. All right, where's the prisoner at? This place is far too big for me to have to run around and find exactly where this person is cowering in a corner. I'm not in the mood. Be in here right now. Please. Or not. Or not. I'm starting to think that the prisoner may have either glitched out or doesn't exist. I've, I've been all over this place. I've ran forwards and backwards. They're not here, man. Was he by you? Nope. Yep. Nope. Mate, they're not here. I don't know where they are. This is really, really bugging me. You want me to go 150 meters? Yep. Yeah, no. That's just leading me to the center of the circle. There's no prisoners, man. There's not. <sighs> what am I supposed to do? Ah, uh, you know what, guys? <laughs> he ain't here. He's not here. I guess maybe it's a glitch because. Currently, as of the time I'm making this episode, they've uh, basically taken away the Battle Pass reward stuff. So my guess is maybe they've made it... Well, maybe some of the, the faction missions have glitched out because you can't exactly get points from them. So, you know, what's the point kind of thing? I don't know. Either way, there's no prisoner. So let's just go and do something else. I just want to use this gun more, man. <laughs> uh, what? What is that? What is that? That happened in the last episode too. 
That, I'm getting out of here. I'm, I'm just going to go. Oh, hello. You guys want me to do some range? I know you do. I know you do. There you go. Oh. That was slightly messy. That wasn't. Acceptable. Not acceptable. You seem just a little 360 then? Trick shots, mate. Only he didn't shoot a single one. Uh, I... I'm getting to a point now because I've done so many episodes on this. I'm not complaining, but I'm running out of ideas of, of, of names for the episodes because so many guns have sort of qualities that are very similar, but like only a few are like making me really wet. Um, sorry for the gross sort of explanation there, but it's true. This gun is on par in the same respect as it as the last gun was, the Silver Steak. So what do I call this? I don't know. I guess like, that's my own thing to deal with, isn't it? But right, we've got a drone camp here. So it's just going to be a case of taking out two of these drones and then moving out. This is going to be a real test of damage. Let's take off the suppressor. And we won't go in true grip mode. We'll just go standard and try and just shoot one all the way with one magazine. Get it down. Get it done. Hopefully it'll work. Here we go. Okay. Okay. Not one magazine, not one magazine. Hold on. One and a bit. One and a bit magazines, that'll do it. We've got this guy, he's mad, he killed his brother. See that sprint? There it is. Oh baby. This now, nah, this is better than the silver stake by a long way. I'm gonna let let it happen. Come on, there you go. Let's do this thing. Send in the murmur drones. Sending the wolves. I want to taste them. No, I don't. No, no, no. I take that back. I don't want to taste anything. But I would like to kill them. I think we're looking at over there. Yep. Oh, mate. They're already freaking out loads. They haven't even spotted me yet. I want to stay still. Stay still. I'm going to guess the wolves are over the ridge. I'm hoping they are. Is everything just over the ridge? There you go. There's one out. I don't want to push. Oh, no. They're coming through now. I can't even see him. Sliding's not good, bro. Okay. All right. Stop falling down. God, you suck. That's that. Oh. Oh. Any more? We're good. Oh, we're good. Uh, if I had to carry around an SMG and an assault rifle, it'll be this. In, in fact, it'll be the loadout that I have right now. The ARX 200 and the Vector Shorty. These two weapons alone, incredible. Fire rate, both of them, incredible. Wait, that's 680. That's 1,200. That, the Vector Shorty has double the fire rate of this. That's why when you fire an entire magazine of the Vector Shorty, it, you can like look. Ow, my head. Just pull my headphones out. Basically, you can fire it all in like two seconds. You can like use up your entire magazine in like two seconds it's madness but yeah this loadout that i have right now not that i'm using the other weapon this is what i take anywhere you got distance with this and then you've got the the close range and the mobility and the fire rate and everything with the smg incredible stuff okay now for an interesting one we've got a sentinel base over here and uh, we just need to clear it out I think it's a perfect little opportunity for me to check out the uh, mobility of this gun. Considering it's got plus 30 mobility. Let's do some close quarters. Stealthy for a bit and then probably get spotted by some random bloke. Scream for a while and then engage massively. Let's have a party up in here, basically. Let's have a real good time. Alright, no one there. There's always somebody up here. Nice. Got him out instantly. Lovely. If there's someone up there, I can't see him right now. I'll cross that bridge in a second. I kind of want to do like a speed run of this place. Just really bust through, take names. No prisoners. Yeah, you are. Who's been sleeping? That's what I want to know. Nice. 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 
Okay, he got lucky. That's all that was, is pure luck. Whoa. Not to... I think it's just crazy when you can kill one of those big guys with, without even realizing that you've shot so many shots into his face within like half a second just because of the fire rate of this. You, I thought you were human at first, so you're dead. Woo! Sayonara! Nope. Nope. Also, I don't care for the swearing at me. Also, that was not hard at all. Don't forget, we're playing on extreme mode. Things should be quite intense. But it's not when you've got a beauty of a gun like this thing. It just gets the rhythm flowing, you know? Gets it going inside my body, my bones. I'm feeling it. I'm ready. I'm liking it a lot. All right, so we've got a truck, I think, or something just over there to go and steal right next to a camp or a compound or whatever you'd call it. But first, I just want to go grab a vehicle from over at this checkpoint while also taking everybody out because I just... What a bit more long-range gun practice, target practice with this thing. Though, annoyingly, I don't seem to be at the right height to be able to get him. Maybe here? If the theory of it is anybody, that is. This could be a dead place. It's looking dead. Oh, no, it's not. It's looking huge. What the? F oh, it's like a T-bone junction. That's one. Nice. I, I can hear people? Or I can hear walking? I don't think it's my own footsteps. Could be. Don't tell me there's two people in this. Like, this is the biggest checkpoint I've ever seen in this game. And there's two people in it. Well, they do leave me with a perfectly beautiful car, so thank you very much, team. I'll be on my way now. Oh. Hold on. Let me just... I think this is single shot. That... That is single shot! <laughs> <coughs> ah, pardon me. <laughs> Sorry. <coughs> I'm gonna be okay. It's gonna be fine. Oh, okay. I thought we shot the, uh... The driver there first, but we didn't. We just shot the guy that got a seat and he laid back like Jesus. Oh, what a good what a good day today has been. Let me know, by the way, what weapon you want to see next, preferably. I probably will have already recorded them because it's Christmas time and I need to get as much stuff as recorded as possible so I can go and spend time with my family. Shot me through two cars there. Um so you might not get a say of what comes next, but at least I'll know for when I come back to recording stuff if I haven't done a gun and you've asked for one. I'll know what to I know what to do. Uh oh. Not today, mate, not today. Nice. There you go. we got hostiles in the area. These guys can't handle me. I can't even handle me right now. Oh! Why were you up here on your own, you weirdo? What a chicken melt. Hmm? Absolute gooseberry pie. There's someone there on this level. Shut up. Shut up, drone. Nobody cares for you. Oh, it's above me. That's fine. Alright. We just need to get that truck over in the distance. We've got a few people to deal with first. This is not cool. Oh. <laughs> Are we okay now? There's, it, there's, there's certain weapons that you use in this game, right? And they'll give you the feeling of being a real professional kind of like army guy. This is one of them. Also, the outfit really helps as well. When you've got the right outfit on and the right gun together, you just feel really good. It's like a proper simulator then. I'm in love. You know? I think I'm in love. I mean, it's pretty obvious. Some may say I'm obsessed with this game. I've done 100 odd episodes. But then again, I was thinking, have I played this too much? I was like, I've been putting it up every day since it came out. But then, all I need to look at is people that play Fortnite every day. For years. 
and put up videos of Fortnite every day for years. That's way more videos than I've ever put up of this game. So, no, I don't feel bad. And anyone that's like, oh, he plays a lot of Breakpoint. Well, yeah, I enjoy it. Well, I'm not just going to not play it, you know? So, yeah. Cool. Delivered. There we go. What do I... Oh, I'm not going to be able to see what I get, actually. I'm going to guess it's skill credits or something. There's not much else they could give us. And I'm hoping it is skill credits because uh, they are very useful. Especially with all the new blueprints that we have available to us now. You need the skill credits to be able to get good variants of them. Especially because even if you hit a certain level, you don't automatically get gold weapons. You still get blues a lot of the time. If you got greens, oh, life would be different. I'd be smashing my computer all over the place. But thankfully, that's not a thing. Got you. Three guys just over here. We'll clear out these. That was pretty nice. There's a car, there's a truck just behind as well. That should have enemies on it as well. we'll clear out these. And then we'll leave it there. This has been a perfect showcase of a lovely, lovely weapon. Nice. Amazing. There's a guy all the way. That, I got a hit in there, which is decent. I can't. That's not even loaded in. That truck's so far away, it's not even loaded in, so that's fair enough. I just really wish we had a better scope for this thing. This gun and the silver stake that we used in the previous episode, if we had a better sort of snipery scope... In fact, the silver stake did. I had that jewel one. If we had that jewel one for this, it'd be in another league. I do prefer this to the silver stake, though. While the silver stake was amazing, there's just the fire rate of this, the way it looks, like I said, everything about this is just... a. It, <laughs> Incredible, guys. But, oh. Thanks for making me look stupid there, drone. I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you so much for watching this episode, guys. I really do hope you enjoyed it, as always. If you did, don't forget to leave a like rating. Let's aim for a 1,000 likes on this video. Subscribe if you are new. Become a member by hitting the join button right next to the subscribe button if you want to do that. Also, check out the links in the description down below. Oh. For the merch, for the Instagram, and for the Twitter. Make sure you follow me there so you don't miss out on future updates from me. And other than that, guys, turn on your notification bell. Because if you don't do that, then you're not a true fan. Anyway, you're amazing. I love you. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.